Once you have imported your data into your file or template, it is as easy as selecting your rooms and applying use groups to each room. So if I select this room, I can scroll down in its properties and I can apply a use group which is preset in the key schedule. The other way to apply a use group is to simply go to the occupant and fixture load schedule and apply use groups manually by room. And as I apply the use groups you can see the data is being filled in. And now that all the use groups are filled in, it's time to create the room tag. The easiest way to do this is to select all the existing room tags in view, copy them down. While they're still selected, simply pull down in the properties window and select room tag dash ol. Now you'll see the square footage is there but the data is not. Now simply going to your add-ins tab and selecting update tags, you will see the occupant load automatically updates when you select update tags. Now if I was to change the square footage of these rooms by simply pulling this wall up and select update tags, you see occupant loads update automatically. Additionally, if I was to select a room, change its use group, and press update tags, you will see that tag updated to the correct occupant load.